Welcome though, my loves. Welcome to your love reading for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. I hope everyone is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. Capricorn, let's go ahead and get started. Holy Spirit, angel spirits and guides, what clarity and guidance, what love messages do we have here today for my Capricorns, please? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Clarity, guidance, love messages for my Capricorns, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs for my Capricorns, please. Holy Spirit, angel spirits and guides, clarity, guidance, love messages for my Capricorns, please. All right, so we have the Knight of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra energy, Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. We've got the Page of Swords and the Queen of Swords. A lot of air energy here. We have the Seven of Wands, the Magician, Virgo, Gemini energy, the Six of Wands, and the Eight of Wands. We have the Two of Swords. We have the Three of Cups, the Ace of Swords, and the Ten of Swords. So Capricorn, I feel like you're realizing that maybe you got yourself into a situation too fast. Um, some of you maybe are realizing you got pregnant too fast, you got married too fast, you committed to this connection too fast. It was just too fast. You know what I'm saying? It was just too fast. Um, you shouldn't have trusted this person so quickly. Um, I feel like you, you're done trying to work on this connection. I feel like you're done being manipulated by this person. I feel like you're done um, stopping your life for this person. I feel that, you know, you want to move forward. You want your victory. You want, you know, you want to be happy. Um, I feel like you don't want to reconcile here with somebody. And the truth of the matter is, is that this is over. Capricorn. I mean, that is just the truth of the matter here. We've got the Empress, Aries, Taurus, Libra, um, Cancerian energy. We have the Ace of Pentacles and we have the Nine of Pentacles. So I feel that um, Capricorn, maybe again, you got married to this person. Maybe you have a child with this person, but I feel like you are fine all by yourself. You are fine. All We've got single empress and committed empress. And I feel like you are fine all by yourself. You may be wanting a new beginning here. Um, we have the, like, you know, you just want to start your life, go somewhere new, travel somewhere new. We've got the seven of swords, the five of swords, and the knight of pentacles. You have someone here possibly younger than you, but this person is taking forever to commit and get their life together. You have someone that manipulates. You have someone that sabotages you have someone that lies and treat just this person just treats you like crap you know so whoever i'm reading for this is someone that's just very slow to keep their promises we've got the moon card cancer piscean energy the fool aries energy and the devil i feel like you're tired of this person playing you for a fool you're tired of this person going behind your back you're tired of this person just you know this person could be uh, could have a sex addiction. They could have uh, be a pathological liar. They could have a drug addiction, a drinking addiction. This person is just chained to all types of negative crap, and they are completely that you cannot rely on this person at all. You never know where they are. You never know what they're doing. You never know what's going on. Um, it's just very toxic. It's very toxic. You have the Ace of Cups here. You have the Ten of Cups. You have the Four of Pentacles, and you have the Sun. You know what you want, Capricorn. You want to cozy up with your person. You want your person home every night. You want a home. You want a family. And you're realizing here, it's time to stop investing in this. It's time to stop waiting, Capricorn. Um, we've got the Page of Pentacles. We've got the Four of Cups. We have the Ace of Wands. We have the Knight of Cups. I feel that Capricorn, an apology is coming in. An offer is coming in. You'll look at it. You'll read through it. You'll sit down. You'll think about it for a minute. But ultimately, I think that you're going to choose to pursue a connection where there's love, where there's passion, where there's a future. We have the Star card. Aquarian energy. The Hermit. Virgo energy and the strength card you don't want this anymore you're being divinely guided to walk away from this you are being divinely guided to walk away from this capricorn you just don't want to be treated this way anymore um and you don't need to be 
You don't need to be treated this way, Capricorn. We've got, uh, what my point is by you don't need to be, it's not like you're going to lose financially. It's not like you're losing, so you're not losing something other than someone who mistreats you. King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy, the Seven of Cups, and the Nine of Cups. I feel like there's this energy of you never loved me. You never loved me. You just wanted to keep leading me on. You're sitting there, you know, drinking drunk, laughing at me. You know what I'm saying? You know, this was, it's always been about what you want. You're just leading me on. There's this energy of you never really loved me. We have the eight of pentacles. We have the five of wands and we have the seven of pentacles. You have watched me work hard. You have watched me fight. You have watched me invest. You have watched me put my best foot forward in this connection and you have just sat there laughing at me this whole time five of pentacles the chariot cancerian energy and the knight of wands you know i feel like there's this energy of somebody that um let's just say you get a flat tire this person goes ghost. They can't be found. They decide to just go and disappear. Let's just say you don't have money for the light bill. You can't get in touch with this person because they're off doing their thing. Okay. This person is never around when they are needed. This person is not responsible. Um, I feel like there's this energy Capricorn of you having to handle everything, everything by yourself. We've got the four of swords and we have the page of wands. You're tired of broken promises. You're tired of hearing that things are going to get better and they never do. We have the death card, scorpionic energy, and the hanged man, Piscean energy. Um, you're done waiting, Capricorn. You're done waiting. We have the six of cups and the king of swords, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra energy. This may be the father of your children, the mother of your children. This may be a childhood sweetheart. Um, or you may be realizing that the innocence is gone in this connection. You can no longer bring yourself to that place of innocence. You can no longer bring yourself to forgive anymore. When you know, you constantly know what the outcome is going to be with this person. You know that nothing is going to change here. We have the three of swords. This person has hurt you a lot. Um, and, you know, you have been stable. You have been committed to this person. You've never done anything to hurt them uh, with temperance here. And the two of cups, all you're looking for is a soulmate connection. All you're looking for, you know, Capricorn is a relationship that you can call home. All you're looking for is someone that will love you, someone for you to love back. You're just looking, you're asking for the most simple, basic commitment. You know what I'm saying? Standard. You're not looking for anything over the top here. You're just looking for your basic standard commitment, you know, things. And with the eight of swords and the nine of swords, you have been trapped in hell with this person. You have been trapped in hell with this person. Maybe it's because you are married to them. Maybe it's because you do have kids with them. Maybe it's because you didn't want to break up your family. Um, but again, there's a very strong energy of a decision needing to be made. And I feel like you're starting to realize that there is definitely something better out there. We have the High Priestess, Cancer, Piscean Energy, and the Ten of Pentacles. Um, I feel like... Capricorn, you are manifesting. I feel like you're starting to save money to leave. I feel like you're, so, you're, you're manifesting. You're planning on how to get out of a situation. You're starting to save money to leave. Yeah, three of wands. You know something is better out there. You know something's better out there. And uh, some of you may be in this energy of stashing money so that you can go. We've got the two of pentacles and we have the judgment card. Um, I feel like you have been in this energy of having one foot out of the door for a very long time. And a final decision is being made here. A final decision is being made here. I feel like someone is about to um, leave. Someone is saving up to go and pursue their own happiness, pursue their dreams, pursue what they want. Someone is tired of being laughed at. They're tired of being played for a fool. One person here has really been handling everything on their own while the other person just goes off and does whatever they want to do. And whenever shit gets tough, this person cannot be found. They cannot be found. Okay. All right, guys. I love you and take care. Bye.